Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Blaze Keller. I hope you all are having a wonderful Thursday afternoon. Certainly, these open skies are helping maybe with some of our moods. Take a look at that. Really not a cloud in the sky on our Doppler radar. And if we take it out to a bigger view, you can see clear skies well off to our north and west, which means that even upstream, they're dealing with clear skies. So we're not going to be dealing with any clouds here over the next several hours, to say the least. So get out, especially after work, and soak up some of the sun. We're hanging out in those mid to upper 30s right now. 38 in Middleton, 34 in Mineral Point, as well as for those of us in Monroe and Janesville. Looks like we're coming in at 32 in Platteville. So maybe a little bit chilly out there for some of us, but overall we are doing some melting and we're about maybe a degree or two cooler than the same time yesterday. But certainly it could always be worse. Now our winds are out of the north and west, and though we're seeing plenty of sunshine, we're, as I said, doing some melting right now. So we're chipping away very slowly slowly at our snowpack. We're down to uh, less than a foot on the ground there in Janesville, as well as in Madison, Lone Rock, Camp Douglas, still holding on to about a little over a foot in Monroe, as well as in Platteville. So we'll hang out in those upper 30s as we go into the rest of our afternoon, settling into those low 20s overnight. Your evening commute or really any driving today is going to be okay. Again, we did see some freezing this morning. Expect that tomorrow as well. The evening should be fine. Maybe just a few puddles in, on, in and along the roads kind of where the drain should be. Again, future tracks showing those clear skies, maybe some clouds moving in overnight and to kick off our Friday, but then we'll chip away at that cloud cover as the day goes on. Overnight Friday though into Saturday, that's our next chance for some snow. You're actually kind of seeing it right here. It's not going to amount to a lot and whatever we do pick up is actually really going to quickly melt into Saturday. And again, I know the conditions are nice. We want to get out, maybe do some ice fishing. Though we're warming during the day and freezing at night, always just a nice reminder, check the ice thickness before stepping out on there. It should be thicker than four inches for you. So again, no ice is 100% safe. I just want to make sure everybody is safe out there. If you want to do some fishing, March is in like a lamb on Monday, upper 30s, plenty of sunshine. Other than that chance Friday into Saturday, maybe a little spotty chance Sunday morning and okay. then that's it. I never thought yeah. we'd see that forecast this time I last know, week. I'm so excited. <laughs> Me too.